So we have this arrangement that is rotating with an angular velocity omega. We have a spring connecting the two ends and the mass m is kept at the center. The combined stiffness of the spring is equal to k. We need to find the time period of small oscillations. So let's shift this by a small amount and let's check what will be the restoring force on this mass m. And from there, we will see what is the time period. So because the body is rotating, let's analyze it with respect to the axis of rotation. So with respect to the rotating frame, there will be pseudo force m omega square x outwards. And because it is moved by distance x, the restoring force because of the spring will be kx inside. So net restoring force is kx minus m omega square x which is k minus m omega square times x. So time period will be 2 pi root m upon k minus m omega square. Now obviously this makes sense if k is greater than m omega square. So if the spring is quite uh, stiff, only then the mass will move inwards. Otherwise, there's a good chance that this mass will just go to the extreme end. So that's what we can see from this uh, equation and otherwise also see this is the restoring force. So if kx is greater than m omega square x, that is if k is greater than m omega square, then the block will move inside. If, if the forces are equal, so if k is equal to m omega square, then the block will stay wherever it is. And if outward force is greater, that is if m omega square is greater than k then when disturbed the block will simply move to the end so that's what we have written here so these are the three conditions so the stable equilibrium so when the object is at the at the at the axis then the equilibrium is stable when if you move towards any direction if you disturb the block it will come try to come back to the center so stable equilibrium occurs when k is greater than m omega square in which case the particle will per observe SHM and other two case there will be no oscillations so when k is equal to m omega square neutral equilibrium it will stay wherever it's kept and if k is less than m, m omega square then it is unstable equilibrium so if it is disturbed it will just go to the other end all right